Hey, good morning, Jeffrey Paul with an inspiration for you this morning to start your day and to hopefully empower it. You know, it takes a lot of bravery to be yourself. In fact, most of us don't even know who we are. You know, we go to many people go to psychologists and counselors for that question and to get that answer. Who are we? But we've been told who we're supposed to be. You know, politically correct uh, issues have created us to speak in a certain way and to act and even to think in a certain way. But you know, to be like somebody else, to be like anybody else, we, we, we omit from the world the most precious gift we have to give to the world, which is us. Our own personal original, which there's only one of a kind. And you know, anything outside of one of a kind is just a copycat. Who are you? Have you ever thought about that? Have you ever had the opportunity to see yourself just play or be yourself or clown around and then catch yourself and go back into the form or the ability to be who you're supposed to be or who everybody thinks you're supposed to be? I have a very close friend of mine, Angelo, who he is truly who he is. And the reality is, is that he continues to coach and teach me and other people that he moves their lives toward closer to being who they really are. Just be yourself. But he gives you the warning or the disclaimer. A lot of people are not going to like that. A lot of people are not going to accept that. A lot of people are going to kind of really be discerning that you're problematic. But the truth of it is, you have a power and a strength and an ability and a gift that is unique to you. It's time to find that you. It's time to release that you. It's so important. You know, Romans says, no longer let this world conform you to its likenesses, to its ways, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. So today I want you to and who we are. Parents, so that you have nothing to hide, you have nothing to get behind, you have nothing to worry about. Because now, you are who you are. But it does take a transformed mind. And that comes from truly going within and hearing that voice within you. Describe you, show you in the mirror, and then when you look into the real mirror the next time you have the opportunity, look into that mirror, look into that mirror, and say, I am who I am. And I like, in fact, I love who I am. And I'm going to be all that I can be of who I am. You have a great day. Share this. Judas on the line. Jeffrey, we just enjoy. You got your comments. Please send me comments. Send me those little buttons of love and those little buttons of hearts. Share this over and over. Share it with all of your, your Facebook friends so that we can get the world to be themselves, to enjoy life, to be empowered, to be the best they can be. And of course, to change the world from the inside out. I'm Jeffrey Paul. If you want more inspiration, go to jeffreypaulblog.com, jeffreypaulblog.com. It's a little bit of a word twister, tongue twister. But in turn, you hit the inspiration button, you get all kinds of beautiful sharings, teachings, and a lot of interviews that I do with authors and inspirational people that are just incredible. Have a beautiful day. Remember, beauty and change begins within. Now let's go change the world.